चल चल ट्रेन खड़ी है डब्ल्यू टी सी जीरो में विच लेफ्ट और राइट is more than just manhattan yes repeat after me new york is more than just manhattan so today we are stepping into a whole new area of new york brooklyn and this video is going to be your guide to what to do in brooklyn how to reach what to see here what all to eat and how much it costs to do all of this so throughout today's video i'm going to be sharing all these details with you and also stay tuned because I'm going to be showing you the most Instagram worthy places in Brooklyn. Let's go. If you're planning to reach Brooklyn from outside New York, then the first step is to take the PATH train. And this train will drop you at the WTC metro station, which is basically the Oculus metro station. And once you reach the Oculus station, just put Brooklyn Bridge on your Google map, take any exit, and you can just walk to it. It'll be just about a 10 minute walk. We just got out of the path and before we walked to Brooklyn Bridge, just stopped here for some bubble tea and this is one of my favorite brands of bubble tea. It's actually a Taiwanese brand and I had so much of it when I was in Taiwan. So when I spotted it here in New York, we had to stop though it's really cold and ideally you should be having something warm but can't say no to bubble tea. So all over New York you will see something very typical and that's the smoke sometimes near the subway sometimes on street like this so you'll see a lot of smoke coming out of manhole covers like this this is basically coming from the subway but I'm not sure why uh, so if you have been to New York or you're from here and you know the reason then please leave a comment and let me know take a walk on the Brooklyn Bridge. The bridge is about less than a kilometer long so it will take you about uh, half an hour to 40 minutes to go from one end to another end. It's a very beautiful bridge and on one side you'll see the Manhattan Bridge, on the other high, uh, side you'll see uh, the tall buildings and the skyscrapers of New York. So take a leisurely walk along the bridge, enjoy the view and as you walk along the bridge you'll also see a lot of photo opportunities so make sure that you click those photos. we are now in the Dumbo area and Dumbo stands for down under the Manhattan Bridge overpass and this is the area which is between the Manhattan Bridge on one side and the Brooklyn Bridge on the other side. So Dumbo mein kya hai? Dumbo is an area to chill. So you have nice views, you have good cafes, you have little bit of shopping, you also have a park nearby. 
so once you're done exploring the Brooklyn Bridge, you can come down here to Dumbo, uh, have your lunch, uh, take some pictures, and just take a walk along the river. Grimaldi's and this is one of the most popular pizza places in Brooklyn so you can head to Grimaldi's for lunch apart from that there's also a Shake Shack here so thanda mausam mein kuch garam khana hai to Shake Shack mein fries are amazing you can have them as well We are having the classic pizza, which is basically uh, their tomato sauce, cheese, and you can also choose your own toppings. So, being a vegetarian, that's a very good thing because then you can choose whatever you want to put on. gallery you'll see a lot of street art and uh, you might also just come across people i mean it's winter right now but in the summer season there are also a lot of artists who are you know out on the streets sketching and just making cool things third thing that you need to do in brooklyn is to come to brooklyn heights Brooklyn Heights is I think one of the most upscale areas in Brooklyn. It's absolutely beautiful. The streets of Brooklyn Heights will remind you of all the American television series that you've seen. Uh for example, How I Met Your Mother. And also there is a promenade along which you can take a walk, especially if the weather is nice and sunny like it is today. And this promenade not only gives you an amazing view of Brooklyn but also of Manhattan. I feel at any moment Barney from How I Met Your Mother or Ted from How I Met Your Mother. is just going to walk down these stairs and you know head to the bar head to mclarens and the amazing thing about the brooklyn park is that you can also see the statue of liberty from here so right from here behind me is the statue of liberty so if you're not planning to go to the island or not planning to take the ferry then you can just view the statue of liberty from here I know that the first visit here can be pretty overwhelming because there is so much to do, so much to plan. I did weeks and weeks of research before I came here. So if you want to make this entire process hassle-free and really easy for you, get in touch with me. Me and my team will create a customized itinerary for you depending upon your time, depending upon your budget, depending upon your family requirements, and this will make sure that you not just see New York but you also truly experience it. So if you are interested in this do check out the link in the description box below you can uh, book a one to one consultation session with me and I'll be happy to help you out guys this was the video on brooklyn and i hope you found it useful and i really hope that this helps you plan your trip and plan your day in brooklyn when you come here i have more videos on other parts of new york on manhattan on downtown on financial districts so if you're planning to come to new york make sure that you check them out as well So that's all for today. I'll catch you in another video in from another part of New York. Signing off till then. Bye.